Today I got a brand new YouTube with you guys. Today I want to uh, break my story. Uh, this is what I will do. Okay. This is gonna be a new tutorial. So yeah, please um, um, comment what you want. I'll do this in a more brief thing. So okay, first of all, what you want to do is you want to go to Minecraft. Now you got the tag and you should see this one which I've created. Okay. And you click on these buttons right here and you just choose a button and What I want to do is I want to click on 
this one here, and now I'm wanting to do this one for you. Oh, this one. Okay. Um, uh, now I look at uh, these three dots. I'm gonna do uh, the gun here. Skin down and hit this um, this one. before there was these boxes that means there's going to be three boxes in between both sides so yeah we do a lot of waves but i think this one is quite good to do i'm sure that i'm going to do that yeah this one is okay okay go now this one more grass that's good go to the next bit. Um, how do you make um, um, Edetus uh, rotation? Um, and how do you make the plane? Uh, first of all, uh, I'll use a camera, set all these to zero, I mess with the set one, um, I'll set that one to one, one minus one thousand five hundred. So now I can see the middle one. Uh, now what I do is I go to these set bits. I will split up all the edges like this and um, allows me to put the two on the middle. Hold control down and you can put the two all at the same time. Do all of them like this. So um, yeah, now I want to make these four fractures um, and you have to keep this one hold the E and you can make um, four of them. This, click on this one. Now we are going to use this one to make the plane. Click, um, or you can actually can also use this one. Uh, you just take this one and drag it into the middle bulk here. Yeah, right there. Right there. Ah, you just make the middle bulk um, uh, the left. You do the left one. This will take. This one and do the other piece again. The end should be the easiest one because uh, there actually a mark where you make the edges right here. This one right here should be great. It will not be that hard for you to make this one here. Okay, now we got E is probably the hardest one because you cannot really see when where it's gonna be in between. Uh, but this one is actually quite easy to do, but th there's a lot of other ones which are quite harder. So, yeah, that's good. Okay, now just rename them so I got control over them. E, M, M, M. Now I put them in scattered bits because uh, now I put them like this, so when I open it, I can uh, make my next um, uh, loop. I just put them all into the loop like this, and yeah. Um, now I want to show you how I do the plane like this, um, because what I don't want to lose is the ability to select all these individual fractures. You just do them like this. Um, what I want to do now is I want to click on this fracture, and let's do it. I just uh, find the plane with plane, click on this one, go to this one. See, now I can rotate them very quickly. Um, 
so yeah, the answer here is yes. We will not use any special functions in this case because we don't need them. I can't do it better right now. Um, so yeah, so we say now we will uh, we will use this uh, function and then we will uh, use this one. Yeah, it's quite long and it's quite long. Actually, I hate this when this happens because normally I work with this one. Actually, the first time I did this one, it was just like this. Just like that. Um, no, just this one. Or how to do this? This one. Actually, I can't do it better than that because it's too long. Okay, now we should. Um, this one is. Okay, what I want to do now, um, if I want to um, just use this one, I will simply say exist, then color, and then print. Because this is our square now. Uh, because I am just making this, and for the sound, you can just keyframe that and make this super long. Oh, you have to make it bigger. Please try to put it at the middle. Right now it fucked up, so please don't use this one if you want to put it at the middle. <coughs> That's how you uh, make it super tight. So yeah. And now to the camera movement. Um, normally I just do um, this circle and put the camera at the middle. Now I want to show you how to make um, a what is it called a bouncing. Belly drop, which is this one here. Let's zoom out a little bit. Not very, very much out, but it's this one which is a belly drop. So I just make it and put this somewhere here. I fucked something up so very very much much not yeah it looks like the mess at the end of the video so yeah this PR is not quite good but yeah okay um <coughs> I think he has the beat so 
Now we're going to make it big, uh, this um, is going to make it smaller because it's going to take one bedroom um, per month.
thing to do this time, but because um, I am recording this, it will take a little bit more time. So yeah. Perfect, easy, and probably the perfect slide for you to go to. how I make my song and how I will record my EP soon after this one. So yeah. So now we can play it and see how it is. Every time I hear um, a drop like a bass, I'll set it to 120, and every time I hear a big like a sound or something, I'll set it to 140. So yeah, that's that's how I do it.
in a week. Is that every time we hear the splash drum, we just get a response from the notification screen? Or to set it to the six, I'll, I'll normally say six is the new one. This one's six, so this one is four. This one is either, either one. So this does that for me. This one will go seven. time we get um, each so this one is one this is zero that one is four so this one is one yeah and this one is one so this one is one yeah that's close to it
gøre før man kan tage nogle fags. The first effect we're gonna add is the black box, which is just a new um, solid in this gun in black. Um, and now we are gonna mix choice. Let's see. Choice is equals to zero, which is this one. Um, we should choose that this one sets the speed a little bit. This one is good. This one gets the speed up to like 13 or something.
That I think this is probably uh, what I want to show you guys. Um, now I want to show you guys how I render. You just click on the drop and you just as render here and then now click on the render just like this. I'll show you guys how it is. Yes. And um, now I just go down here and set this one. So normally I set this one to this one, but right now I got this position right here and I don't know how to fix it. Um, but yeah. So 
hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, please do like, comment if you like this video, and I'll talk to you.